but we aren't talking about this just for funsies. It's here that we're talking about it because there is an estate planning lesson to be gotten out of it. That's why you're here watching us. Yes. <laughs> That's why we're doing this is we want you to learn and benefit. Madison, what would you say is the lesson here? Yeah. So the big lesson is this is all stemming from a distribution from Greg Allman's trust. So he had a trust, which is great because he had seven wives and five kids. So, I mean, it's a good thing that he had a trust and he passed away in 2017. So we're pretty sure he is aware that his son either had a drug problem or was predisposed or could have, or there was a possibility his son had an addiction problem and his trust could have had provisions in it for this possibility. And it did not. So the lesson is that if that is a consideration for anybody's children, you can make the trust say that. You can have those provisions in there in case there is an addiction problem or that money needs to be held in trust. Or if you know that that money needs to be held in trust for somebody, you can set that up in advance. Right. And in his defense, Greg Allman's defense, we're talking about $120,000 a year. It might be that it says $10,000 a month. We don't really know, but you know that's one way of kind of managing the money from the grave. But as it turns out in this case, it's not effective enough. You can do more. You can control the inheritance much more tightly if necessary. And it's a lot easier for the trustee to have discretion to be looser with the money than it is to give the trustee discretion to be tighter. Like there's a lot more uh, litigation involved if all of a sudden the trustees like arbitrarily like, you know what? Nope, I'm going to hold on to your money this year because you have a problem. It's a little bit easier if they're allowed in the document just to hold on to it. But then they're like, oh, I'm going to be nice and give it to you. Right. It's yeah. If it's if the other way around, it's a little bit easier to less litigious. <laughs> right. All right. So that's your estate planning lesson of the day. <laughs> just uh, plan ahead. If you need to protect your children, you can do it in your own planning.